Are you asking if I get pumped up? Uh, how do you, how you get, do pumped, you get pumped, up? pumped up? I don't. I just pump my hair up. That's all. I <laughs> yeah, that's good enough. Oh. That's okay. all we do too. She I, I didn't back, do it I today. Pump it up. I'm from Texas. It just works. But all right, Danny, we love having you here. But and you're gonna come back. We'll be right back you're with coming. more of him and more top 12 competition right after this. Let's have one more final From the American Idol stage, where your top 12 finalists are awaiting their fate. Ooh, Ooh. scary. One face is missing from the top 12 who should have been there and his name is Danny Noriega. <laughs> well, you went home last week, but guess what? He's with us tonight. So now we're going to break down last night's Beatles theme performances starting with David Archuleta who sang We Can Work It Out. We'll work it out, honey. That's right. Check it. What? It was like watching Superman go down the first time he like got near Kryptonite. Now, do you think that this is going to affect him in any way? I don't think it's going to affect him. He's too powerful for that. <laughs> yeah, every, he's human. It happens. That's you know true. I mean? That's true. So, okay, you're young. You're 18 now. He's 17. You're standing on that idol stage. You see the American Idol sign. You see the audience. You see the cameras. What makes you go to that place where you're just not in the zone anymore? Um, I try to like not think about it, especially like like when it's live, yeah. yeah. It's just raw fear, <laughs> so I like, guess. Uh, yeah, it's like weird. It's like I think I'm gonna like crack or something, but as soon as I'm on the stage, it's like boom, you know? Nice. What's it like? Boom, boom. <laughs> we have to well, boom, boom, yeah. boom. Oh, we're Rosie, boom, honey. <laughs> hey, boom. All right, so we got Katie and <laughs> Thank, you. Thank you so much, Rosie. Now let's take a look at Ramiel, who sang In My Life and dedicated it to her friends or right friend, Danny, who has left the show right there. Have changed. Okay, Danny, do you think you have better hair or do you think <laughs> Ramiel does? She definitely does. It's easier to put like tracks in her hair too. <laughs> <laughs> well, what you said is that you could have bought a weave with the amount of money that you paid for these shoes. Yeah. I know that was supposed to be exclusive behind the scenes, sorry. Yeah. Back to Ramiel. So now you guys have a special little hard sign. <laughs> Tell me about that. <laughs> we we call it the corazón. Nice. Yes, yeah, right here. Can you get a shot of this right here? See it? Uh, that's Aww, awesome. Beautiful. Look at that. Oh, I heart you, Danny. So we love you too, Rami. Okay, next up, somebody who we also love, Amanda Overmeyer singing You Can't Do That, which blew away Paul and Randy and myself. Check it. You know, she's been accused of being a one-trick pony. What did you think of last night's performance? She's amazing. Everything she does, I'm a fan of. I love her. I thought last night was amazing. I had it, like, all the way up. I told my mom to be quiet. I was like, bump into it. You're like, Mom, be quiet. Amanda's awesome. Like, she's just, awesome. She's, yeah, right here, right here. <laughs> yeah. okay. well, speaking Rosie. of awesome, Rose, who you with? What up? We're here with another Katie. We'll sing their final song and head home. Aww. Aww. We're here with Danny Noriega, who said goodbye last week and is helping us break down the rest of the competition Woo! on deck, singing across the universe. Here's Michael Jones. I think you just fell more in love with him, didn't you? I can't even talk right now. I can't think. But anyways, Danny, what did you think of the performance? It was pretty heartfelt, huh? Yeah. I love put words in your mouth. Yeah, I love him. We call him Papa Johns because he's like the dad of the family. Aww. Yeah, he always tell me, go bigger with my hair. Oh. Go bigger, bigger. Go bigger. <laughs> yeah. Well, nice it's a little guy. strange that he's giving you hair advice, but whatever. That's all good. Yeah, it was a good performance last uh -huh. night. <laughs> Kim is in the audience with a devoted fan. What's up, Kimmy? Well, I'm here with Yvette. So we can we can just form an improper <laughs> thoughts club. Why not? <laughs> last night, Saisha Mercado sang Got to Get You Into My Life, which earned good reviews from all three judges. Take a look. Now, she opened the show. Tell me, how hard must it be to go out there and to open the top 12 show. Thank God I didn't have to do it. <laughs> I feel so bad for her to do that, but she did amazing. She's the funniest person ever. Like, I can sit there and I call it the grandma laugh, like that. <laughs> we can't breathe. Oh, that's, yeah. <laughs> Love her. Oh, that's so jokes. funny. All right, Kimberly, what's going on over there, honey? Well, I'm here with the team today, but okay. All right, Danny will be back later in the show, but up next, last season finalist Brandon Rogers is here to share his thoughts on Carly, Jason, and more. Don't go anywhere, amigos. Come on back. We are counting you down to tonight's results show, Single Tier. I'm season two finalist Kimberly Caldwell here and with my boy. That's right, I'm Justin Guarini, season one runner up. We are back last week's, with last week's eliminee, Danny Norris. Are we hosts? Uh, is that what we hosts. do for our day job? Okay, Ooh. good. And
anyways. So let's end the hour with the cooks. First up, cook it up. David Cook uh, rocked out with Eleanor Rigby. Check it out. Now, it looks like the idol stylist got him. He's a rocker, but what do you think about what he was wearing last night? I liked it. Um, I like everything he sings, too. Everything's so original that he does. It's like, it comes from like his heart, and, and he's so, such a good guy. It's genuine. And Kim loves him. Yeah, I'm not a fan I'm at all. <laughs> not even a little bit. Call me. Sarcasm, okay. everybody. Rosanna, where are you at? You know, I'm here with Sarah. I'll fight you. And now for Christy Lee Cook's country style version of Eight Days a Week. Justin's got a little. Justin likes the blonde country girls. Yeah. What do you think about Miss Blonde Country Girl? It's funny seeing them like on here because like I know them. It's like weird. Yeah, but um, I love her to death. <laughs> yeah, but anyway, so. <laughs> She's What's so your favorite good. thing about her? I like her, the country vibe. Even like with everything she sings, she has that country thing to her, but it's so good. It's like yes. soul, though. It's like, mm, you know? And it's pretty amazing to see um, the stylists and the makeup artists yeah. and the hair people get a hold of all these people and just kind of touch them up, just yeah. polish them up a little bit. Yeah. You were already polished. Really? Yes. <laughs> Thanks. All they did was give you a black leather jacket. You worked it out. Yeah, but each week I was like, do a bigger thing. Like, <laughs> more teasing. More I want hairspray. the Amy Winehouse look today. How big uh, hello? can it get? Huh? Yeah. How big can it get? Um, it can get big. Well, yeah, it can get pretty well, okay. big. Okay. You know yeah. what? Yeah. Let's <laughs> just, let's wrap this up. Yeah. Now, as we promised, we're opening the vault for never before seen footage of an American Idol auditioner with very unique, mm, unique talent. Okay. Yeah. Is it weird that maybe I have those gold pants? Ooh, Danny, kinda, you've got that head bob thing going on too, right? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, do it. Mm. Ish. <laughs> Ish. Ish. Now, Danny, guess what? You have a fan in the audience who has a question. Whoa. Hi, Danny. I was just wondering, um, what was your favorite song that you sang on the show? My favorite song that I sang on the show was Tainted Love. I thought it was fun because you have that, that little like runway walk. I had yes. to do it. And I did the Pussycat Dolls version. And, yeah, and you did the thrust. Mm, mm, that's you can that's teach right. the girls from there next time. Love. I can uh, tell them they have a hard time walking. Uh, that was hot. But you don't. No. Yeah. So tell me, what are you going to remember most about your experience on American Idol? I'm going to remember the friendships and the relationships you, you get from even the staff members and stuff. They're yeah. so amazing. Even the, like, the, like, the littlest touches make like a huge difference. It's, is this a little touch? Yeah. Did it make a big Look difference? Look at me now. <laughs> it's such a difference. We Very love literal. Danny here at Idol tonight. Absolutely. So amazing. Everybody loves him. Come on yeah. now. So what are you looking forward to from the rest of Idol? Um, I'm just looking forward to them being consistent and being really good and true to themselves. That's really important. And also, you're going to be in the audience every week, correct? Yeah, for Ray Meow. That's yes, because he wasn't deal. last week and he, he got yelled at. Yeah, Ray So Meow this week, he's going to be there. Yeah, yeah. I'm going right. to be there. All right, Danny, Excellent. thank you so much for being here. Thank you. You're so cute. And thank you guys for watching us on TV Guide Network, America's TV Network. American Idol on Fox is kicking off in just a few minutes. That's right. We'll see you back here next Wednesday night. Good. Bye. Bye.